In this video, I'll be showing you how to change your network's Wi-Fi password or network name. First thing you need to do is find your IP address. So search my IP, and Google provides it right here. Of course, there's many other sites that can tell you your IP address as well. Copy that and paste it in the address bar. If you found the correct IP, it should prompt you to enter a password. If you entered the wrong IP, like if I just remove one digit from that, the page will just load forever. It'll say something like the connection timed out. That means you entered the wrong IP. Your public IP is the one that's shared by anybody on the same router as you. But if that didn't work, you can also use your personal default gateway. In Windows, go to Command Prompt, and then type IP config. See right here we have default gateway. I'm going to right click, mark, select it, and copy it. On older versions of Windows it's harder to copy, but you could just type it in. Go to the address bar, paste it, and you should be prompted to enter the password again. Default gateways usually start with 192, and I'll put a link to a video on how to find it on a Mac. This is the trickiest part. Your username should be admin or something similar, but your password is probably going to be different from the one you have for your actual network. So the Wi-Fi password for the network here is not going to be the same as the admin password. I've changed mine, but if you don't know what it is, you can usually click escape, and then you might be able to enter the serial number and help find in your login info. Once you've found your admin credentials, just type them in and press login. Now this is your router settings. You go to wireless on the left, and then here I have two networks. First one's called One Sun, and here's your passphrase. You can type in any text in here, it will display it for you, it won't hide it like many other password fields. Then you just click apply and the password will be updated. Anybody who's currently connected to the network will be booted off and they'll have to re-log in. This network does have a password, but of course if I wanted to remove it completely, I could just check none. And then I have to apply those changes, and then my network would be open like this other one. As you can see, I have two networks on this same router, and this second one, the name has spaces, so they are allowed, but any special characters are not. If you want to change that admin password, go into Advanced, Administration, and Set Password. Now here you'd enter the old password and then type the new password twice. This is assuming that you know the old password, but since you're on the screen you should. And you can set up password recovery and answer some security questions just in case you forget it the next time. You can also see the attached devices, so who's using your internet. See, this is the IP address of my computer, because there's only one thing connected, and any other devices would show up lower down. 